option to withhold its bid to release the management of Mumia's sugar company. Group chair Narendra Raval has told Channel One that the company will engage all stakeholders in a bid to conclude the matter amicably. This comes even as the receiver manager KCB says the negotiations are still ongoing and the details of this lease agreement will be made public once concluded. In September 2019, Mumia's sugar was placed under receivership by KCB Group with the aim of protecting its assets and maintain its operations. A statement from the receivership manager says it has so far rehabilitated hundreds of acres of land as well as hiring people to work on the plant, calling for investors to run the affairs of the sugar miller. Under the leasing deal, the successful firm is expected to run the plant on behalf of KCB whose 545 million shillings in loans was defaulted by the miller. Dovekey Group was among the eight companies that had shown interest in the revival bid. Dovkey has indicated plans to pump in 5 billion shillings into the operations of Mumia's sugar company. However, in a statement today, the company said it was withdrawing from the bid due to political interference. The firm has, however, reconsidered its decision to withdraw her bid to lease Mumia's sugar. In an exclusive interview with KBC, Devki Group of Companies Chairman Narendra Raval said he is willing to take over operations of Mumia's sugar company in a month's time should there be an agreement with all stakeholders. Stakeholders comes together, all the leaders comes together, farmers comes together, and of course the receiver comes together. I have no problem to sit with them and uh, and, and make a plan how to to have the way forward to, to start the, the Mumias. Raval said that he plans to lease Mumias sugar company for 20 years and is ready to inject 5 billion shillings in the first four years. I could have given the chance, could have made sure that the livelihood comes back. Of course, there is politics everywhere. It's not that uh, there is no politics. Politics will be there. If it is healthy politics, I do not have any problem. But if it is dirty politics, then uh, I am uh, myself keep away from that. This comes even as the receiver manager, KCB, says that the negotiations are still ongoing and the leasing process is not yet complete. A section of Western Kenyan leaders have also appealed to Devki Group to help in the revival process. Plead with my fellow politicians, be it members of parliament, be it governors, be it senators, please let's not bring politics into this venture. Read the Receivership Act. A teso ambayo tumepitia na umaskini ambao tumeona na ufugara. Ata kama mimi sijajua Devki. Na na moyo, sisi tumemukaribisha.